We're in Outlook Web App 2019. This also works with Office 365. I'm going to show you how to create an archive. So we're in our inbox and we're logged in as Tom Jones. And so what we're going to do is we're going to click on the archive button. Now, the first time you click on this, it's going to set up a special archive. So that way you can't accidentally delete things uh, that you would have normally in your inbox or your sent items or deleted items. But the second time you click on it, which we'll show in a minute, it will do something different. So let's click on archive on our inbox and we'll click a create a new folder called archive or we can archive messages in a specific folder and we can choose any folder that we want. I'm going to choose to create a new folder and click OK. And now we've created a folder called archive and it's moved this first email into that archive folder. Now if I go to my deleted items, for instance, I've got more items in there. I'm going to uh, go ahead and highlight this first one and I'm going to click Archive. Now since I've already set up my archive, it's not going to ask me that again. It's just going to move it right into my archive folder and there it is. In previous versions of the Outlook web app, you would right click on the folder and choose Archive. But now in the 2019 and Office 365 versions, you're going to see the archive when you highlight an email and you'll see it showing up at the top as one of the menu items. So that's how you set up an archive using Outlook web app. This also works in Outlook as well in versions 2019 and 2016.